So we've been talking a lot about different chargers uh, for your bedside table. It could be your desk. Uh, right. But the, the idea being it's going to charge your phone and your watch and maybe something else, too, like your AirPods or some other Qi pad that, that can charge things. And the one that I've been using and and the one that I'm still using, although now more reluctantly, is the Belkin one, the, the Belkin 3-in-1. And it works great. Don't get me wrong. But this 12 South High Rise 3 uh, that we got to see at Pepcom is I like even better because it is compressed. It's it, the three in one, the way they did it, the base of it is a, basically the size of an iPhone. So it takes up the size of the iPhone and the watch sits behind the phone. It's a MagSafe thing. You put your MagSafe phone on it. Boom, you're good to go. Obviously works in a MagSafe case. And then you just hang your watch kind of off the back. And then the, the base of it also has a cheap pad. So you could put another phone there or you could put your AirPods or whatever. Uh, I like this form factor a lot. And 12 South has made it look good, whether it's, you know, even when your phone's not in it, which kind of makes a difference. It's 99 bucks. So just like the Belkin one. Now, the reason I say that I'm still using the Belkin one, there's one reason and one reason only for that. And that's because my daughter grabbed this one after I got home from Pepcom and it is now set up in her room and we'll be heading to Italy with her. So uh, I, I still use the Belkin one. No complaints, but now I know what I would like better. In fact, my wife walked into our daughter's room uh, the other day. She says, now I know what I want for Christmas. <laughs> she pointed to this. She's like, this is perfect because it takes up the amount of space as an iPhone. I'm like, yeah, I get it. Now, you had something on the Cool Stuff Found list that looks a lot like this. And instead of it being 99 bucks, I think the one that, that you found, Pete, is how much? 39 30? $39.99. $40. Today, yeah. while we're recording, it's actually even less. It's $35.99. Oh, there you go. There you go. Perfect. Yeah. Tell me so, about this one. So, so the link's in the show notes. There's a couple things about it. It's similar in, in form, uh, not obviously not identical. Um, it does a really nice job of, of gr grabbing the phone, as all do the as do all the MagSafe chargers but you know there's no doubt in your mind that it's locked on there the the one drawback that i will give it is that it in the back it's wider where you set the watch and because it's wider i think the band tends to interfere a little bit in the way so unless you're very uh proactive in setting the watch magnet in making sure the magnet grabs it 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 could sit there and not charge um, but that's the only drawback that I've found to this thing. The thing that I really like about it, it's got three little lights on the front that tell you whether or not it's charging. And these lights don't keep you awake at night. They're bright enough to be seen, but they're dark enough that you don't have to find black electrician's tape to try and, you know, <laughs> take, take away the laser light that, that will burn your retinas out when you're trying to sleep. <laughs> okay, so that was my question is, do the lights stay on all night? Because the the 12 South one, the light turns on when you put a device on it, any one of the three, to let you know, yes, I, I see it, everything's good. And then after a minute or less, the light turns off. So, so that's, that's even more brilliant. It is. So, okay, that's where your part of your $65 Delta comes from. It's okay, fine. Yeah. You know, f fair. Yeah. Um, the... The watch puck on the the 12 South one is raised up. It looks like it's raised up more. I'm looking at the pictures of these because I don't have the, the you know, the, the, the Van Smuggo one that you've got, Pete. But right. it looks like perhaps that problem with the band pulling it off of the, the chart, pulling the watch off the charger might not be as much of an issue with the um, with the the uh, with the, the 12 South one. And right. that's not surprising, right? The 12 South folks, like, they, they, they all, they're like Apple, right? They will go the extra mile and, and figure out the things that need to be figured out. And, and they sort of follow an iterative design kind of, you know, process. But it's clearly both, I think, though, are probably, at least mine is clearly the latest charger. It, it quickly charges the watch up. It, is, it doesn't take, you know, a couple hours like my old watch chargers do. My oldest pucks take forever. Got but it. The new ones. Yeah. Oh, that's good to know. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's fascinating stuff. So thank you for sharing that. So there's the the, the $100 version and the, the $40 version and and you can you can take a look at both and decide what's for you. But this is this is a, a like a great way to go.